how do we achieve throttle nobody asked me how much throttle to give somebody was asking me why 3000 rpm yeah so what we do is what you do is motorcycle we use our body weight okay so how do we use our body weight to turn motorcycle we are not going to turn like this because as i told you initially i'm not putting any weight on the handlebar we have the strongest muscle which is our leg thigh we'll use it for a good good reason okay first thing you see a cone you have to go right what do you do you put weight on the right foot peg as soon as you put weight on the right foot peg your handlebar tilts okay and then what you do is you are already gripping your knee slightly move your knee ahead and move your butt out my knee ahead okay when i move my knee ahead the motorcycle is down and you are counter balancing the motorcycle by moving your butt out so your body position we'll go back elbows out your vision is ahead you're looking straight your knee is slightly bent and it's forward to turn right your knees will go straight on the left hand side and then you move your butt out on the left to go left what you do is you put weight on the left foot peg when you put weight on the left foot peg your handlebar tilts towards left you slide your right knee forward and move your butt back you get that why do you move your butt back because you are counter balancing the motorcycle when you ride on the road you are counter steering here you will be counter balancing any doubts no doubts so what if so far we get to know that okay at uh, some point of time bike is leaning towards other side so how do you so there is something called as dab in case if you fall you tap and you recover you not letting the motorcycle fall i'm standing right now in case i'm falling i put my leg out and then i correct it to dab it out there is this technique where you can just accelerate a bit to get the bike straight you're not doing that we are not doing that right now okay so that comes very advanced okay. this is level 1 so yeah okay okay no usually yeah so there is a thing called as when in doubt throttle it out okay. what we say is when in doubt throttle it out okay. so when you give more acceleration your bike comes to a straight position but here there's a cone ahead okay you'll run into a cone okay. okay so how do we achieve throttle nobody asked me how much throttle to give somebody was asking me why 3000 rpm yeah so what we do is Your clutch is your insurance. 
in this particular exercise you are not lifting throttle to go forward you are using your clutch to move forward you get that point Standing, we understood how do we stand. We understood how do we hold the motorcycle with our legs, and we use our hands just to navigate it slightly. Okay, we are not fighting with it because we had a demo. If you are fighting with your handlebar, you will lose all the grip. Okay, so use your legs to balance the motorcycle. Okay, and then when we stand and ride. I want you to play with the clutch. I don't want you guys to blip the throttle on off on off. Keep a throttle constant. Keep your throttle at 3000, 4000, whatever you feel like, whatever you're comfortable with. Keep it constant and play with the clutch. Use your clutch to move forward in case if you're going if you feel you're going faster, pull it in. So when you pull it in, what happens? Your speed reduces. Got it? Six years since we did some warm-ups. Let's do some warm-up, and then we'll do some warm-up on the motorcycle, and then we'll start the exercise over here. And after that, we'll take a short break. But before that, I want you all to drink one bottle of water, 200 ml. And please gear up right away. I'll give you exactly five minutes.
बाबू स्लो स्लो Ha ha ha.